Hello guys, welcome back to another season, another video. Welcome back to Talk Top Until I Die. With me, Sean Nagel. Uh, where do I start? Lovely, great, great, great day today. 1 0. Win for the Spurs against Manchester City. Oh, absolutely lovely. Um, yeah, thoughts on the game. I'm not going to talk about any individual player like everyone else is talking about. I'm going to talk about the players that was on the pitch today. And, um, Nuno, I thought Nuno got his ban on. First 15 minutes of the game, I thought we was uh, being a little bit dominated, if I'm not um, mistaken. I thought Man City took, took a good grip hold of the game, 15 minutes. Then I think they dropped a little bit, and we sort of took over from there on. Um, especially in the second half, I thought we was pretty dominant in the game until the last 10 minutes when De Bruyne came on. I think he made a difference, but um, it's a good start. It's how we mean to go on, and uh, we need to continue this into the, to the next one. Views on the game, a few points. Um, although the new signings, um, I know Romero come on for two minutes. Um, yeah, I thought Eric Dyer was very, very good at the back today for some reason, and I'm, that's me saying that, Eric Dyer. Um, but... We still need to build up the future without him. I'm sorry, I just can't take to the geezer. Um, you're going to get a good game like that from Eric Dyer. You're going to get that from any player in the world. But that's what they do consistently, that matters. Let's start with the goalkeeper. I thought Lloris looked different today. I thought he's, he was catching more than, than usual. Usually he punches, which puts you in panic mode. Um, Hugo Lloris, I thought, yeah, done done a very, very good job today. And I was, I was quite happy. I weren't as... A lot of the time we've been used to passing the ball back, especially Toby Oliveira, he, he just loves passing the ball back, pass back, pass back, pass back. Um, the, it, it weren't a possession game for us at the back where we could afford to do that, so I'll see that over the next com coming uh, weeks. But, yeah, it was, it was nice because my heart, is, I tell you, my arse goes, Pfft, as soon as that ball's get back to the it's like that, watching Bert Leno, well, Bert Leno's a little bit worse, but that's another story. You just, just don't know what you're going to get of them. I thought the right back was fantastic today, Jaffet. He had his work cut out. He was aggressive, very aggressive, which is great. Bullying him. He bullied Sterling and that. Um, I'm going to give him the man of the match for me today. I thought he was excellent. Uh, the other full back, Regulon, yeah, he's just done what Regulon does. Um, when he's needed in attacking areas, he's always there, he's reliable. Uh, defensively, I don't know, I don't even remember, remember much of him defending, to be honest, but I thought Sanchez was pretty good and I thought Dyer was good, like I said to you. Hoiberg was a um, normal Hoiberg, uh, him, making interceptions, I thought he was very good. I thought Oli Skip had a great, great game, the youngster, just full of energy, bumping the bat. Um, then we move on to... Who else was in midfield? Mora? Mora was in midfield? I think Mora was there. Mora, I thought, was brilliant. I thought he was dangerous. Every time we got the ball, he was looking to run and attack people, take people on. Um, I was happy of him. I thought he was very good. Uh, I'm trying to think who else was in midfield. It was Skip, Hoyerberg. Well, let's just pick the players as I can remember him. Bergwijn. Very, very busy. The geezer still got to work and he's finishing. Um, but he's always involved. Like he gets, he works hard, gets involved. I like that. And I thought he had a pretty decent game again. Son Heung Min, uh, first two chances we had of him, he went backwards, which a lot of the Tottenham fans were, <laughs> were like, "What the fuck is he doing?" No one could understand. But then again, gets you shot away for the goal in the second half. That's that's it. I mean, how many is that now? I think that's eight goals against Manchester City he's got, he's got in his career. I mean, that's that's quite phenomenal, really, for any player in today's football with Manchester City. I thought he was great. Uh, and, uh, listen, we move on to the next game. I'm buzzing. I'm absolutely buzzing. Uh, predictions for this season? I think we can get top five. Top six. Top six, I'm going to go. Top six. Um, just, just, uh, yeah, good day, good day, you know. I'm going to have a nice little bevy there, celebrate. On to the next game. Bring on the, 
warms away. And uh, I'll be over the ground myself for the Watford game, so come on you Spurs!